Today I am doing a everything I've ever thrifted haul. I have been trying to be a little bit more sustainable. I've been using metal straws, I've been using reusable cups, and I've been trying to do more secondhand clothing work. So that is, or clothing work, clothing shopping. So that's why I've been doing a lot of thrifting, just because it is a little bit more sustainable for the environment. And so some of the things I wanted to show you were that I actually, these jeans that I'm wearing right now were actually the first things that I've ever thrifted. They were more from a vintage store, so it was a little bit pricier. They were about $30, and they are from Denim & Co. And then I also got a pair of camo pants, but I did not bring those to college with me, so I unfortunately cannot show that in this haul, but if I can find a picture, then I will show it right I need to go in chronological order. So the next thing I ever thrifted, this was before the start of my senior year. I went to Goodwill with a couple of my friends and I found this dress. This dress is from American Eagle and actually has like the old American Eagle tag. So it is very, like you can tell it's early 2000s. Obviously, obviously you can tell this is a very like high school musical dress. It reminds me of my, of Gabriella Montez when I wear it. I just think like I'm Vanessa Hudgens. I don't know. I like it a lot. Additionally, I then got this yellow three-quarter zip crew neck or half zip. I'm not exactly sure what you would call it. Uh, it is one of my favorite things I've ever gotten just because my favorite color is yellow. And it's really warm and cozy. I've also worn it to the beach a lot. And it is a men's large, so it is fairly oversized. But that is also like a big style lately. Originally when I got it, I was thinking I was going to crop it, but then I decided not to. And also, this is by the company Arrow. And I believe it's made in the USA because it says USA there. So, it's kind of nice. Then, I got my very first Levi's. These are baby's first Levi's, which makes me super duper excited. Because I've always been on the lookout for another pair of mom jeans after getting this first pair. And so these are them. They're a little bit on the more loose side. These are definitely a little bit big for me, but whenever I tuck in like an oversized shirt or something like that into these, then it works out perfectly because these are a size 8 and I'm not sure what my size is. I think it might be like a, for dresses and such, it's usually like a 2 or 4 and so this probably would be like a 6 typically, but yeah. So I, these are my first Levi's and I'm very excited about them. And these ones were only $10, which is pretty good, or at least that's what I thought. But then the game changed when I came to Spokane because I went to a thrift store and I bought four things for $3 each. So the first thing I got was this men's medium Jamaican like shirt and the reason I got this is because I find that like this is something that I feel like I'd see okay, yeah I call it Jamaican because it says Jamaica Jacks that's the that is the uh, company authentic island style and I feel like this is something you'd see at Urban Outfitters especially if it's cropped I've seen some girls wearing plaid versions of this so that is just something like a reason why I got it and it was only $2.99 so that made me really happy I also got this other button up. This is a woman's four, size 14 but for petite so it's a little on the shorter side for what a normal size 14 would be but it's also large and so what I like to do is I like to roll it up and then I also like to tie it in the front because I just think it's a really sweet button up. I love this style of fabric where it's kind of bohemian and, and it's like part lace but part not so that's just something that I really enjoy. And then I got this another yellow shirt because I cannot get over the color yellow. It's just my absolute favorite color, if you couldn't tell. And this is a woman's 2XL cropped yellow polo. I just love it so much because when I wear this with mom jeans, I can tuck it in. And it's just, I feel like it's a very Brandy Melville style. That's like kind of where I'm getting this like pullover idea from. And I like how it can just like, it looks super oversized and if I just roll up the sleeves a little bit, then it looks a little bit, I don't know, it just, I'm definitely feeling the oversized feel lately. 
And then the last but not least thing that I got was these Tommy Hilfiger denim shorts. So, I think these might be my, one of my favorite finds. I think these ones were only $2.50, which is like a complete steal to me because they're Tommy Hilfiger, which at Urban Outfitters, everything Tommy Hilfiger is super overpriced. They are a little bit on the longer side and they are high-waisted, but I just rolled them up a little bit. And they, on the back, they have this little Tommy Hilfiger kind of thing that you can see. And obviously, with a belt to cinch in the waist, this is just really good with any fall sweater for some of those warmer days in fall. So, I'm sure you can see my big pile of clothes right here. I, at first I was really worried about thrifting. I never really wanted to do it because I wasn't sure if it was the most cleanse, cleansely, clean clean option. I don't know. I'm slightly germaphobic and so I would get kind of like scared that like the clothes wasn't clean but I know that like they can't really sell things without washing them and such like that. You can find some really good deals and so although it can be a little overwhelming when you first start it is like <laughs> sorry I thought my roommate came I didn't want to be weird. So it can't it can actually be a really good option because you can find really unique things that other people might not have or you can find dupes for new styles that are really trendy but you don't want to spend all your money on it. So, Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and just let me know by either leaving a like or a comment or just subscribing. Thank you so much. I'll see you next time. Bye!